All right, hello everybody. This is uh, Rig Dog. I am back home from our trip on the Mojave Road, Mojave Trail. Had a really good time. Had a good group with us. Uh, time went by really quick, but we did stop and see a few things. We saw the lava tubes, and we went hiking a hole in the wall, and uh, we had a lot of fun just driving down the road. We saw the frogs in the mailbox, and uh, and uh, let's see, it's Monday. I got home about 3 o'clock. I took my time driving home, spent the night at Afton Canyon. So I'm here editing some of the, uh, as you see in the background here, I'm editing some of my video. I got to go through and see what I got and see what I don't have. But uh, I had a great trip. Uh, nice meeting everybody out there. That was fun. I have to do it again some other time. Morning people, this is Rick Dog coming to you from National Trails Highway, better known as Route 66. Right now I'm par paralleling I-40 out, out of uh, Barstow and I'm headed towards the uh, state line. I'm going to meet some folks out there and uh, we're going to do the Mojave Trail going east to west. We're going to start somewhere at the Colorado River from what I understand. I guess I'll find out when I get there see what their plan is. But uh, I figure I'd take the scenic route and see what Route 66 has to, sh has to offer here. Get your kicks on Route 66. I thought I'd stop here and take a little shot before I moved on. Still out here traveling. I-40 is uh, behind me there. And I just come down that way. I'm just paralleling the highway there on uh, Route 66. But I uh, thought I'd stop and show you the uh, ancient volcano out here. If you look out there. That was a dark area, all oh, that's uh, lava. All oh, that's lava rock. It's the PISGH, I think, volcano, ancient volcano, or crater, whatever they call it. Hey, let's take a picture around here. Yeah, this has some color to it, huh?
All right, one more thing before I move on here. Um, if you go look behind me this way, out that way, I think that's Broadwell Dry Lake. And uh, that's another way to get out to Afton Canyon. If you're adventurous, uh, you're gonna take, I think, Broadwell Dry Lake Road or Broadwell Road. Takes you out past the dry lake, keeps on going, and then you eventually run into the uh, railroad tracks out there at Crucero, and you make a left and follow them back to the I-15 in Afton Canyon. So, that's another trip I gotta do. Uh, who knows when, we'll see. It all depends on funds, you know. This truck don't run on air. Coming to you from Route 66.